Hello and welcome to watching this video. In this video, I want to teach you what is 3D channel in Adobe After Effect. When you select your layer and go to Effect menu here, you can see 3D channel group, and here you can see all 3D channel effects. Okay. The 3D channel effects work on 2D layers. 2D layers with 3D information. If you want to use these effects, first open, for example, Cinema 4D, Cinema 4D or 3ds Max, it's no matter. And after that, you should render that. For example, here we have this model, and here I create this camera and turn around this model. Very good. Now, when you want render that here in save in format you should select RPF or RLA select RPF and render this model after render that here you can see for example here you can see 90 RPF file after that you should open after effect and here select first RPF file and you should here turn on this checkbox and after that select import and here you can see that RPF sequence and after that drag and drop and now when you change this indicator as you can see here we have RPF sequence and this layer is 2D but it have 3D information when you select that here you can see file have ZDEF object ID and other 3D information. Okay. Now select your RPF file and in effect 3D channel select 3D channel extract. When you apply your effect here, as you can see, it show in effect controls and in 3D channel here we have many options. For example, here is Z depth. If you select that here you can change black point and white point and now when you play that like this and for example if you change it to texture UV as you can see it's like texture UV and surface normal or coverage if you select coverage as you can see it changes it to pencil drawing like pencil drawing and you play that as you can see it's really cool and here background or material you can select that option you need okay delete this and next is dev mate if you select that, here we have two options, depth and feeder. Now, if you reduce this depth, as you can see, you can change depth of this 3D model. And with feeder, you can change feeder of that. It's very useful in your matte painting. And with this you can change this depth. Very good. Or you can select this invert and as you can see it's invert now. 
okay delete this dev mate and um, next is the of build if you select that with this effect you can add the of field uh, for example if you increase focal plane and increase maximum radius for example to here now when you increase focal plane thickness as you can see you can change this depth and when you change this indicator it change increase that change this maximize and here you can change this the path field okay in next video i will teach you what is audio effect in adobe after effects thank you for watching this video and goodbye